السلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته today i'm going to talk about the most difficult journey in the whole of my life in the journey november 1977 after i finished my internship training in al azhar medical school hospitals and travel to london then to abrestwis to do my license to get my license and start working as a medical doctor. In the previous year, 1976, I was in Abrestos for about three months uh, after a good qualification, and I went to be trained in a, a hospital called Bronglis uh, General Hospital. It was like an, uh, enjoying my holiday there. But taking the Egypt Air flight between Cairo and the Air International Airport and the Heathrow International Airport this was the most difficult emotional feeling at the time because I felt by the time the plane took off and I was in the middle of the skies that I was cut off from my deep roots, from my culture, from my values, from my family, from my friends from my relatives from my past to an unknown unseen future that's why this emotional pressure at the back of my mind and my head and my heart led me to go into a weeping uh, state thus because i don't know what will happen to me after leaving my family and all my relatives and my friends. That's why I was 27 at that time, and uh, I was not prepared to have this pressure on me. By the time I landed uh, into Heathrow Airport, I went to the small motel or hotel or guest house. I stayed there for about a week or so to submit my paper for the PLAB or TRAB exam to have the license to become a medical doctor. Then I was guided by one of my friends who is a pro- associate professor in the University of Aberystwyth in Wales. And he told me to come and take the train and told me about the uh, names of uh, the stops and how many stops and uh, till I arrived to Aberystwyth. Uh, so he booked for me a room in the uh, university's uh, residence. I was in the train like this. Well, was someone who come from the countryside as a farmer and first time he's traveling, does not know the Welsh language and the, even the English language and the name of the cities and the name of the towns and so on. So till I arrived after about three to four hours to a breast with, uh, from London because I have to change trains I arrived there and he booked for me this uh, uh, room in the university campus. I was uh, staying there, you know the culture of the university campus and you eat the breakfast and of course everything as I was told that's halal apart from eating pork or swine uh, meat. And uh, the intention there was to stay in this area uh, to be trained in the hospital and to uh, try to pass the exam or to sit, uh, to pass the exam, to have the license and to be able to get a job, proper job uh, in the hospital. So to be very honest, in spite of the fact this are the, the journey was about four hours, but this was the most difficult emotional journey that I have had in the whole of my life because I felt that I'm like a branch of a tree was cut off. The pain from being cut off from the stem of my tree, the pain of being detached from my culture, my family, my friends, my colleagues, my relatives, my past, having no clear future to see made me to weep the whole uh, journey, during the whole journey. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.